welcome back to the channel and today Yuzi and I are going to be trying to catch a plane with another plane but without using tractor beam magnet things or anchor blocks or anything like that. It is actually going to be using a similar hook system from when we did the uh, uh, catching a plane on a submersible sub. So we're going to be trying to actually hook onto the plane and cradle it in the air underneath the larger cargo plane. So I think Yuzi is going to be building the large plane that catches the smaller plane. I'm going to be building the small plane that has to very, very precisely fly into the right position to be caught by the cargo plane. Does it sound about right, Yuzi? Sounds right to me, Scrapman. All right, well, uh, let's go get building. All right, so I've got the what I think is the easier job this time, where I've got to build a very tiny aircraft, whereas Yuzi has to build the very, very large one. But I just got to make sure that this thing, it can fly really, really stable and controllable especially at lower speeds because we're probably gonna have to slow down to match the speed of the cargo plane and uh, we want to be able to fly at a nice level flight so we're not like constantly adjusting our altitude these flaps might help us uh, gain some extra lift at lower speeds i don't know how fast his cargo plane is going to end up being but if i make mine light enough hopefully this should be able to float like a feather when needed it's just gonna be a matter of balancing that center of lift all right i got a super basic foundation here for this plane uh like i gotta keep it super simple because i need to <laughs> i just realized i didn't put any any thrusters on this thing at all. How is this thing supposed to go right now? Maybe is this going to be a propeller based plane? That's a pretty big propeller for this. All right, so it flies. Not too bad. Uh, I don't know. It does actually seem not to. Oh, oh, I have an issue. Oh, I have a big issue right now. The roll, I, just, I forgot to uh, program my yaw. Right now, my yaw is hooked into my roll controls as well. There we go. That should hopefully work. All right, let's see if this feels any better. I will activate the flap wings as well for takeoff. Okay, that is actually really interesting. The flap wings do seem to have a, a good effect. My only issue right now is it does tend to nose down just a little bit when I'm flying naturally. But if I activate the flap wings, now you can see it does tend to like... It just kind of noses up a little bit, but it also seems like we're gaining altitude while flying straight. Yeah, there's, I have an altitude sensor on the back of me right there, and you can see it going up, even though we're kind of level. But I mean, it feels nice. I wonder how yaw feels. Here we go. Okay, the yaw is absolutely terrible. It always is for me. All right, I am not completely satisfied with this thing yet. It definitely feels like uh, we nose down a little bit too much. You're gonna have to try to fix that somehow so we can just have a nice, stable level flight where we're not doing anything. Ah, uh, you know what? The propeller is actually what did a lot of it. Uh, the propeller is 25 kilograms and that just completely, look at this. Look at our center of lift and mass is perfect right there. Adding the propeller to the front actually ruined it. So I wonder if I can fix that with some rear thrusters here. All right, that actually does even it out a little bit. Okay, oh, that flies way more level. And let's see as we slow down, add the flaps in here. I don't like that at slower speeds, even with the flaps activated. Yeah, you can see that we still nose down in a weird way. Hmm. Let me change this to a smaller propeller. It might actually look a little bit more natural too. Let me also move these wings down because it looks kind of weird that high. Yeah, that looks much more natural as well. Okay. It's actually feeling not too bad. We actually have too much lift in the front. <laughs> It is a balancing game, but I don't know if I like this tail. Like th these things just look really, really big. I might just swap them out for a single large tail fin. This just might look a little bit more natural. It does, it really does. All right, now if I activate the flaps, oh, you can just see we gain altitude. I think I'm kind of happy where, where it's at right now. This might be kind of the best case scenario of what we can deal with. The only thing is I do not have yaw, but I might not need it. All right, I've made some more minor adjustments and now I'm treating the water as my landing zone. I want to approach the water as close as possible without actually like touching it. And just see how easy it is to maintain that kind of altitude. And you can see as I'm like, as I'm throttling my speed here, it's actually really easy to fly nice and straight over the water. Look at this. And the more gas I give it, I just get a little bit a little bit more altitude. Like I think this is a nice angle. It's not perfectly level, but it actually it maintains my altitude really nicely, which I think if we're coming up underneath a cargo plane, 
this is what's gonna do it here. Look at how easy it is for me to maintain. And then if I put the flaps up, then I can go even slower. Look at this. Uh oh, whoa. Oh, oh, look at this. Oh, this is gonna be easy. This is gonna be so easy. Wait, can I like drag across the water? Oh, <gasps> that's so cool. I'm like, I'm hydroplaning with these flaps. All right, ready? No way, look at this. I never thought I could do that with this plane. All right, that is so cool. Oh, no, and then I went underwater, dang it. All right, I gotta be honest, I'm really happy with this. It was a pretty simple build, but uh, I, I think it's gonna be perfect as far as our controllability goes. Got to do one landing test though. Here we are. Look at that, not even a sound. Right, I'll just paint this thing up and then it's uh, up to user to finish that cargo plane. All right, scrap man, let's see your build. Have you finished? Uh, yep, it felt like a pretty easy build. Definitely less time consuming than the big giant ones. <laughs> <laughs> yes, um, yeah, so let's see it. All right, there it is. Oh, a little prop plane. <laughs> Yeah, uh, it does nice. have some uh, some thruster support in the back, though. Oh, okay, yeah. Yeah, uh, mainly for balancing issues. I needed some extra weight in the back. But yeah, I think it uh, it flies pretty nice. Yeah, if you just feather the throttle a little bit, you should have a pretty easy time. There's also some landing flaps that gives you some extra lift at lower speeds. Uh, Ooh, so hopefully... That's a good idea. Yeah, hopefully it'll be able to adjust to whatever your cargo plane speed is. All right, well, do you want to see my cargo plane? Yep, hopefully we're a good fit. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're going to be really surprised with the size of this, so let me show you. Oh my goodness. Oh, well, this is the wrong version. <laughs> <laughs> there it is, nice and painted, all finished. Wow. It's a beast, I know. All right, well, uh, how does it work? How, what, what am I, how am I supposed to land on this thing? It's pr basically the same system you designed, so I press one mm -hmm. and it pops out. And I press two, it will clamp the wings in. Hopefully that's enough space for your wings as well. It's gonna, it's gonna be a question on whether or not you get in between the tail and my uh, main wings, or if you're gonna right. hit my tail. Let's just do an initial attempt and see how it goes. If I get this first so try, this is gonna be a short video. All right, well, I am ready. So let's get going. Are you, are you gonna tail behind me? Yep, all right. Oh. Okay, you oh, might have to um, repair a little bit. <laughs> uh, thanks, Scrapman. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no problem. All right, well, I'm just gonna go ahead and take off. All right, man, you got a lot of, you actually might be pretty fast. I hope I'm as fast as you are, actually. <laughs> oh yeah, true. I'm going oh. right now a steady 110 miles per hour. All right, let's see how fast I can get up to. I had a little bit of a hiccup there. All right, I can break 110, so that's a good sign. All right, I am catching up. I might have to adjust my pitch sensitivity does feel a little bit oversensitive at times here. Okay, I see you. What I'm gonna do is uh, extend my rods. Okay, this is suddenly feeling like it might actually be pretty hard. So I see, ooh, I'm just realizing, yeah, I'm, I'm seeing, I have to kind of hit the top rod there, the one closest to your body, don't I? Yeah. All right, that might actually be pretty hard. You gotta squeeze in there. All right, I'm gonna start a little bit lower here. This here is looking go. good. Oh boy. Uh, oh, oh, um, oh, 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 my tail what? might be a problem, I'm oh, realizing. Oh, I had no idea about the tail. I yeah. forgot completely. Oh, no, oh. That's, that was <laughs> devastating. Okay. All wow. right, so, hmm. yeah, there. I'm going to try to shorten my tail here a little bit. <laughs> I'm also going to make a slight adjustment and make, like, my fuselage a little bit hollow so your tail could fit in there snugly. Okay, yeah, I'm, I'm actually, I'm switching it out for the small tail fins, so it should be much less obstructive. I'm ready for take two. All right, let's do it, take two. All right, I'm gonna follow you off here. Oh, I see, I see the gap there. That should be useful, I hope. Hopefully. All right. Oh. Oh, boy. All right, hold on. Oh. Steady, easy now. Okay, it's me, right. I'm, I'm tilting. Oh, yeah, you are a little bit tilting there. <laughs> Level let, let off there a little that. bit. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. Yeah, this is feeling more stable for sure. Just gotta sneak in there. All right. Oh boy. Oh, oh, oh I careful. am surprised I survived that. I activated my <laughs> flaps to see what that would do, and uh, I'm going too fast for the flaps. They give me so much lift all of a sudden. All right. Oh. 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 
Uh, you want me to try? Oh, go, 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 go. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll do it, I'll do it. Oh my god. Oh, oh no! Oh, that, that I was, was like so in the close. perfect position. I think you might need to add one more block to the middle uh, rods. Okay, to make it a little bit longer. Okay, I can do that. Or what? maybe two more to be safe. I don't, actually, I don't know <laughs> if that's safe or not. At least one well, more. One or two more. Yeah. I don't know. We'll have to see what, what works best. I'll try putting one extra small piece on for now. Mm -hmm. And uh, we'll see what happens. I'm going to do an experiment here too, where I'm going to swap my backwards my uh, or my rear boosters to an actual with different key. And that way I can use them separately for my propeller. So maybe I can have an easier time matching speed. I can use ah. them to boost to catch up, okay. but we'll see what my propeller does by itself as far as my speed goes. I go take free. All right, scrap man. Let me release the prongs once again. All right, I'm coming in. Okay, wow. My propeller by itself is actually like just slightly slower than you, it seems like. And it also does change. Hmm, it does. Oh, boy. It oh. does seem to change <laughs> a little bit of my uh, center of thrust, too, without my things uh okay it might actually be harder to control this thing than with everything on all at once oh you're getting really close oh yeah this is so much harder oh stable out there scrap man going a little oh. <laughs> can i just land on top of you like the aircraft carrier <laughs> not this video it's the wrong video guy. <laughs> oh, dang it <laughs> oh no oh. Okay, yeah, this is- I'm gonna have to switch back. Uh, I'm gonna try to give this my best go, but I'm definitely gonna have to switch back to having all my thrust on at once. Okay, I'll, uh, I'll swing around, because I'm pretty confident my plane is okay right now, so I'll swing around right. if you want to head back to the cargo. Yep. Uh, well, the aircraft carrier. Alright, I'm taking off again with full throttle. Okay, I don't see I, you. Uh, I see the snow island, I'm heading over the island. Oh, I see you. I see your uh, smoke trails way, way, way up there. All right, I'm on the approach. I see you. Wow, this feels so cool. All right, lowering the prongs. You're clear for docking. <laughs> yes, I'm coming in. Oh, you know what, Scrap Man? This approach is pretty good. Yep, it's just hard to regulate my, my altitude a little bit here. Oh, oh, uh-oh. Uh-oh. Gotta go up. Come on, come on. Carefully. Uh... Oh, dang it, I bounced. Oh. All right, hold on, hold on. Oh, no. Oh. <laughs> that was a little aggressive. Be careful. This You're is gonna like, break something. It is so much harder to approach from underneath than on top. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, uh, if I can get my just nose a, just a little bit a little to the right. Bit. No, that's the other prong in between. Hey, okay, okay go, go, it. go. <gasps> that oh. looks pretty good. That looks good. It's I mean, it's working. Yeah. <laughs> yes. I think uh, I think you caught me. Well, it only took four tries. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know, it's actually right, kind of well. too bad that your wheels couldn't uh, don't extend further, so you could land with me here. Oh, true. Oh, oh, something's uh -oh. happening. Yeah, there's uh, uh -oh. there's some noises, some um, uncomfortable noises going on. Okay, well, I'm gonna take you over the island and drop you before something breaks. Okay. Hopefully this, uh, hopefully dropping me doesn't destroy anything. You're like not in, correct? <laughs> <You're> like... <laughs> yeah, I'm a okay. little bit off to the side, I can see. All right, well, I'm going to let you go before you snap one of my prongs. Here we go. Three, two, one. Oh, Look at that. that was epic. Wow. If I was a glider, this would be like the perfect launch. This feels so yes. peaceful. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna turn back towards the aircraft carrier to come in for a landing. We should come in from opposite sides <laughs> at the yeah, same that's time. What I'm doing. I don't have any brakes on this thing, so I might overdo it. <laughs> I don't have any wheels, so it kind of acts as brakes. How far away are you? I don't see you right um, now. I'm approaching. I'm very close, actually. Not too far. Are you going right or left side? Uh, I'm on the right side. Okay, I'll do the right side as well for, from my perspective. Alright. Oh. I'm trying to land as smoothly <laughs> as I can. It's so much lift. There we go. You're, you're probably going to fall off brakes. the end, aren't you? <laughs> brakes. Brakes. Where's my brakes? Ah! 
No. All right. <laughs> shall we uh, swap roles? Yes. Let's do it. And actually, before we do that, though, I think one more pipe piece extension, one more little uh, extension would be ideal. So here you go. Look after her. She's, uh, <laughs> she's a very beautiful plane. <laughs> let's do it. All right. There we go. Oh, wow. This thing just takes off, doesn't it? Yeah, it's it's got so much lift. It's unbelievable. Wow, this thing is very controllable. Yeah, it's a little agile. I did try to tone it down a little bit on the pitch, but uh, you're going to have to be pretty subtle with your inputs. Suddenly, I feel how difficult this is actually going to be. Yep. Okay, okay. Oh. Oh, oh, that's a miss. All right, let's try these lift flaps. Got some catching up to do. <laughs> I think I'm actually slower with those flaps enabled. Yeah, I don't think the flaps are that great for the actual approach. Oh, 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 oh. oh. Close, oh. close. Wow. Okay, this thing is so sensitive to the controls. Oh boy. Yeah, it feels like that, especially once you get closer to the plane and you realize just how steady the plane is compared to you. <laughs> <laughs> as long as I can pull this off once, I'm oh. happy. Oh, 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 no, I pressed the wrong button. Damn, I pressed no. the wrong button. Oh, that looked like oh. it was going to be good, too. Oh, it's dang two. It. Press two. Oh, I pressed one accidentally. Oh, no, I just reached the end of the map. Lesson learned. Don't press number one after the plane gets in position. <laughs> I see. I'm already on the approach. Oh, yeah, you're close. Oh. How does it look? Oh, Ooh, oh, uh, a little. Oh, okay. It's okay. Uh, oh, it's okay. No, I, I did it again. Doop, doop, doop. Yeah, 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 yeah. All yes. right. There we go. Yeah, we did it. I We're mean, I'm missing broken. missing a little bit of my uh, fuselage here. Other than that, uh, I appear to have caught you, which went much smoother than the submersible version. And uh, nothing's clanging right now, so it sounds good. Yeah, um, it seems like it's a pretty good fit. I'm trying to figure out where where should I take you? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> right, let's gain let's some altitude. Well, let's uh, let's just relax, guys. <laughs> uh, we enjoy this free flight. I'm going to fly low over the bridges, and I'm gonna go oh, okay. over. I'm gonna go over the bridge, but see if you can like dip down into one of the uh, the circles of fire. Ah, okay. So we're gonna do some stunts now. Okay. Yeah. You know, this is one of your most agile big builds as far as plane goes in a while. <laughs> Well, I've had a lot of practice. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to drop you once I get over this first bridge. And okay. three, two, one. Here we go. Oh. Off I go. Oh, a little wonky, but easy peasy through the ring of fire. All yes. right. And then back in, wow. back up, back up for the back, uh, for oh, the dock. Back. Yep. Just right back up okay. and just right, right back in. Just dropping in for the ring of fire and then you got to return. That's the mission accomplished. This is, okay. No yep. pressure then. No pressure. Yeah, just do it nice and quick. <laughs> Let me get my camera nice and close. Oh, come on. Oh, <laughs> oh, 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 oh. oh. <laughs> You're trying to get inside the uh, the little hole you made there? Yeah, I mean, that's one way to duck. Okay. What is, uh, have you tried first person? What does first person look like? It actually looks really cool. I think wow. I might want to try, I want to I check that out before we uh, wrap it up here. Okay. Um. I don't think it's easier to control in first person, but it looks cooler. Actually, actually, I'm saying that. Ooh, oh, oh, catch oh. me, catch me. Uh, just, uh, oh, well, it's something we got. I got gotcha. you. <laughs> I got gotcha, you. No problem. You pierced my wing. <laughs> no problem at all. I don't even know if I can let you go now with that. I'm going to try to go let back me. to the aircraft carrier and come in for a landing. And uh, I'm going to drop you off right before I land. I think if you just let yourself fall, you'll drop behind and then you can try to land, like glide glide down. I don't know. Yeah, I'll try, I'll try and glide this landing. And let's see how the drop off goes. Oh my oh, goodness. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Abort. <laughs> let me turn my engines on. Oh dear. Oh, a little bit of a rough landing, but I think I nailed it. I'm gonna try and land on top of you. I Wait, am. Don't, don't, don't I roll. Am, don't, I'm don't. gonna fall off. I'm gonna. Oh, oh we're going together, <laughs> it friend. Works. It actually we're works, going, though. Oh, <laughs> uh, into the ocean we go. Oh, uh, okay. All right. Let's let's do one more. I want to see what uh, first person looks like this time. All right, I'm all set. I'm already in first person view, even for the takeoff. It's actually looking pretty cool. All right, engines online. Let's get going. All right, 
I am off the aircraft carrier already. Beautiful. I'm surprised the game is running so well, kind of, you know, with this thing yeah, being so big. Yeah, you've got a pretty big craft there. Oh, this actually feels kind of nice. Oh, come on. Oh, you can do this. Oh, oh, come on. Come on. Almost. Oh, just push Almost. it. Once you get in position, just full throttle. Oh, 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 oh here we go. Oh, I'm gonna catch you. It's okay. I got you. We got it? Yes. <laughs> Let me take Beautiful. a look here. That felt easier in first person. That actually was like really good. Wow. That was super satisfying. Look at that. That was the smoothest catch yet, guys. <laughs> yeah, that looks great. Man, this right, is, well, uh, um, I thought this was going to be a lot harder. It felt like it was going to be a lot harder for sure, but it actually isn't too bad. Who needs magnets, guys? <laughs> yeah. yeah. I'm, I'm kind of confused because the sub was the same thing, but we just approached from the top. But it, why did that feel way harder for some reason? I guess it's easier to fly into something than it is to land on something. I mean, yeah, yeah I don't know. <laughs> All right, so you see that archway on the hill on the right. So what I'm going to do, um, I'm going to dive down where the big tall mountain is. Uh huh. And I'm going to let you go pull away. And then you basically essentially got to fly through that archway. All right. And awesome. then I'll come back up and dock again. <laughs> yes. I'm going to try all this in first person too. Oh, you're crazy for that. Yeah. <laughs> I think it's going to be a pretty epic feeling. Getting ready for the big dive. Oh, boy. I see the mountain. Oh, this is, this is so cool. I see the mountain. All right. All right. I hope oh, it's a smooth oh, release. Oh, oh, I have... Okay, I'm going to get you a little lower. Oh, this is scary. Oh, this is scary. Release. Okay. Okay. Wait, pitch down. Go, go. Pitch down. Pitch, I, oh, pitch, up, wait, wait, oh. oh, there we go. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Okay. Oh, I'm under. Oh. Yes. Okay. Nice. <laughs> that was Good so job. disorienting trying to get control <laughs> of that. But I did it all in first person. All right. And I'm coming back for the approach. I thought I was going to hit the um, ground there for a second. You were wow. stuck on me. I know. I yeah. You. It was like a last second release. All right. Mission accomplished. Returning. Returning to base. Okay. I'm ready to catch you. Oh, oh, okay. Right. You know what? That's perfect. I'm going to grab you again. Oh, so beautiful. All right. Look at that. There we go. Like, like catching a baby. Whew, that actually worked. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, first person is the way to go with this thing. This is awesome. <laughs> wow. All right. You know what? Just for fun, uh, why don't you go to the aircraft carrier and just land with me here to see what happens. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Welcome aboard, UZ Airlines. If you look to your left, you'll see the bowl of doom. <laughs> yeah, see, my aircraft is so small, I only have enough fuel for about 10 minutes of flight, which is, this is why we have to do this. See, I'll, I'll act as the brakes to prevent you you're from falling You're gonna cushion off. the landing. That's yeah. what you're gonna do. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right, engine's down. Oh, I might overshoot Yeah, make sure this. you actually hit the aircraft carrier. Yeah. <laughs> Here we go. Here oh. we go. Oh, <laughs> yeah, you pretty much killed me in the process there. Well, there you go. Mission accomplished. All I have is a little bit of a wing left. All right, well, that was another successful co-op mission. That was a really fun one. I really enjoyed this one. Yeah, I'm really liking the uh, trying to land planes on things or catching things without using tractor beams. Yes, it's a, it's a good concept. I'm pretty sure we've kind of milked that idea, though. I'm not sure what we can yeah, do Yeah, I don't know if there's, I don't know if there's any other options for that, uh, but the comments might might know something. They might think of something that we haven't thought of yet, so let us know down in the comments below, and uh, definitely check out Yuzi's channel if you haven't already for some more awesome Trailmakers content. If you guys enjoyed this video, you'll probably enjoy some more that you can find right here on the end screen. Hope this video has earned your subscription. Anyway, this has been Scrapman, and I'll see you next time. Bye!